started a number of years back when I was shopping in East London, and um, it was from a store run by two designers, and I'd never seen it for sale before, never seen it since, and I've never even seen anybody else wearing it. And I love this shirt because of it. It represents me, it represents my style, and I like to be unique. And so a couple months after I got back from London, I wanted to buy something else from these guys, they were pretty cool, and I knew the name of the store, I knew where it was located, but I couldn't find, never mind e-commerce, I couldn't even find a website for them. So fast forward a couple years, and now I'm heading to Cape Town, and I want to see, you know, what's the city like? What am I going to be seeing? What area should I check out? All I can find online is Cape Town's equivalent to our Navy Pier. But when I get there, there's all sorts of streets with really cool small shops, lots of character, like Gray Street right here, and they have some of the best products we've ever seen, especially since a lot of stuff in South Africa doesn't make it to Chicago. And so, when I got back, it was the same thing. You know, you can't find these stores online, you can't buy from them. But we're changing that, and I'm, today I'm proud to present Repio. Repio is the first and only social commerce platform that's focusing on bringing the best local shopping, designers, and artists. We want you to go out and find either Chicago or other cities in a way you've never seen before. Explore, browse, and buy right on our site. And we're doing this unlike any other site out there right now. And today, I just want to talk about two of the really cool features that we're working on at Repio that we think will change how you shop online. The first is a tagging system that helps you get to the products and the clothes that you want to see faster. You don't walk down the street and decide between Saks Fifth Ave and you know, Nike Town. They have different styles, different feels. That's how you shop when you're out in the real world. Why do you have to pick broad categories like men's fashion or furniture when you're uh, in the online? We want to give you tags so that you can get to those clothes faster. The second one is we just launched today a curated guide that helps you explore different neighborhoods and cities that you wouldn't have normally gone to. So again, by style, you can say, I want to shop active or vintage. We'll show you the neighborhoods and the stores, the selected curation of stores that are in each of those neighborhoods. So we've gotten really great feedback on our commitment and our belief to local shopping. There's a lot of people who like that out there. And one example are designers that came up to us within two weeks of us launching with zero marketing dollars saying, we want to be on your site. How do we get on it? And when we asked them, why do you want to be on the site? They said to us, Repio's not going in the same direction as other e-commerce. They're not trying to sell the same thing. They're going aspirational, but through local, not luxury. And we couldn't have said that better ourselves. That's exactly what we want people to think when they see our site. So where do we go from here? We want to redefine local shopping in the context of retail globalization. So that means I don't want Zara or Lacoste or Uniqlo to come over and say, you know, this is how the French or this is how the uh, Spanish or Japanese are shopping. That's not unique. Local is unique. Local is original. So we want to take all of the major cities and connect them in a local way on one platform so you can reach these aspirational shopping centers and buy directly from us or browse and see new areas. So you can find your t-shirt or bike or book or whatever it is that you want. Right now, we're just in Chicago, but we're looking to expand out to New York and LA for our first moves, and looking for some bridge funding to help us roll those cities out a little faster and get some traction under our feet. So I look forward to answering your questions, and thank you very much.